folks, and welcome to another Hag Swag unboxing. Not sponsored as per uh, the usual disclaimer, but hey, maybe someday I'll be cool enough to have sponsors and stuff, but it's not today. So this is just a subscription box that I get anyway, and in the interest of providing people with information and reviews, I'm unboxing it and going through the contents on camera. So that if you're thinking about uh, getting one of these boxes, getting one of these subscriptions, but you're not sure, hopefully this information is helpful to you. If I look like crap, it's because I feel like crap. I got zero sleep last night, but I'm already late um, opening this box and getting it up. So I decided to suck it up and do it anyway. Tried to have a nap earlier, but one of my neighbors is appears to be operating some sort of power saw, so that was fun. It might happen again intermittently throughout this video. I don't know, but we are just going to have to deal with. So I've got my, uh, my kniffy here. I'm like 90% sure that the theme for this box is light work, because the one before that was shadow work, I think was what it was called, which makes a reasonable amount of sense if you are going for balance there, but that could totally be wrong. So let's get into it, and if I'm wrong, we'll be surprised by the theme. There's one, and I already accidentally ripped the tape off of the other side, so that's convenient. There we go. And we are, oh, I did guess right, yes, haha. -ha. It is indeed light work. That is what we've got going on in uh, in this box. I almost said in this video. I'm very tired. But yeah, that's that's quite pretty. Got some nice uh, some nice colors on there, and the back has the thing that's not called a table of contents, but I call a table of contents. So we'll put that to the side for now. So we've got our grimoire page for March 2021, uh, and on the back of it, I know how mirrored images work. There we go, inner light meditation, that's kind of cool. Cool. Our herb, herb, whichever pleases you, is something called bone set, which, cool name, I don't know it, but that's, that's a pretty, pretty cool name. A uh, powerful cleanser of negative spiritual energy. Man, could we all use a little more of that lately. And our, uh, our stone, our crystal, our rock, whatever you want to call it, is soda light, soda light. I'm not going to lie, soda light pleases me more as a pronunciation. Uh, stone of insight, mental enhancer. Cool. That also sounds pretty interesting. We've got another word that I change how I say pretty often. Another decal, decal. And I finally realized that I can actually put these on my roller skating helmet as well. So I don't have to completely cover my mandolin case. So that's good. It's really pretty, actually, with a little sun or something. I quite like the colors. And another one, just a, a branded one, hag swag. I'm just going to excavate. Oh, the little flittery things are everywhere. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. This is going to be a terrible mess to clean up. And right off the top, we have our soda light, because that's how I'm going to pronounce it. So it's, um, let's see if I can actually do this. Boop, boop. Can I? Ah, look at that. I can kind of sort of do it. There we go. So it does have some actually really pretty blues in it. That's really, really nice. It's, it's rough. It's not, got, it's not smooth, but it's really nice. I quite like that. That's very pretty. All right. We have, oh dear. This is definitely something I have trouble sa saying. Satya Sai Baba. I know that one. Nag Champa. Dupe. I'm probably saying that wrong. Cones. So I'm assuming that those are um, incense cones. I guess I could actually open it 
and um, find out. That's probably a pretty reasonable way to answer that question. And I'll just rip through the cardboard. That's absolutely fine. Yeah. So yes, uh, little incense cones. Great. Smells kind of like Febreze, which is a little odd. Ooh, I see a tin light work candle. So we have another uh, instance of this, this great um, image in those pretty colors. Light work candle, daily meditation. So it's soy scented in juicy tropical passion fruit, pineapple, kiwi mingled with fresh coconut. So this should smell like summer, it should be great. Oh yes. I'm smelling mostly the pineapple. The coconut is is coming through. I don't have enough experience with passion fruit or kiwi to be able to identify those as very strong scents here, but that may well just be me and and not the candle. So, yeah, that's really nice and it's a plain white soy candle as i think just about all of their little jar candles are for this company so lovely something in a spray bottle or a cleansing spray Ooh. spray yourself to dissipate negative energies that are sticking to you and lighten your personal energy distill water cool lemongrass Hydrosol, lavender, patchouli, liang liang, palmarosa, and what does that say? Vetiver, vetiver, sure, oils. So again, we've got that same image. Why am I absolutely the worst at this? But I am. All right. Just gonna spray it on like a perfume, that's fine. Hmm. Okay, so I get mostly the lemongrass and the lavender, but there there is something um, sort of spicier, sort of earthier underneath, which I'm guessing is probably uh, the patchouli. But all in all, that's a really that's a really nice scent. I quite like that. It's not too strong. I mean, I know it's not meant to be a perfume, but it did, like it's already dissipating a bit. Like I already can't smell it very much, but again, like it's not a perfume oil. It's a, it's a cleansing spray. So it's not, I imagine if you got quite close to me and I had sprayed myself with this, you'd be able to smell it, but otherwise no, but like, it's also not a perfume. That's not its purpose, but it does smell very nice. And here's our bone set, which I've decided that that's how I, I should say that. Again, I don't know if that's the correct pronunciation. I'm very tired. Pronunciation or not. Oh, we've got a little, um, feels like a raw canvas or linen drawstring pouch. I'm sure this will be explained. We have something in bubble wrap. Everybody loves a good bit of bubble wrap. And this is Chakra Balancing Roll-On. Ooh. Uh, so this one, Cedarwood, love it. Clary Sage, also love it. Lavender, big fan. Fractionated Coconut Oil. I should probably put this on my, my other arm. So we'll just do, do that. Hmm. It's subtle. I could do with this one um, being a little bit bolder. Mind you, I say that, but as my, my body heat is sort of warming it up, I can, I can definitely smell it more. Okay, okay. So it's not particularly strong, but it is, it is pleasing. I'm smelling a lot of the of the sage. That's coming through uh, pretty pretty well. Not so much the cedar wood, which is a bit disappointing because that is a scent that I like. But overall, 
it's a it's a really nice um, little roll on and I'll just continue to be bad at this forever it's a good thing I'm not uh, reviewing makeup products because I would be terrible at it yeah yeah use on your chakra points in ritual to help align okay so again not really a perfume even though anything scented that tends to be how I end up using them but it's it's quite nice I should say um, some of the scented things I might be unfairly judgmental at the moment because I am um, a little bit congested it's starting to get warm here uh, where I live and that means that as things start to bloom and as the earth warms up and things wake up <laughs> I get uh, I get allergies so it's not too bad at the moment because there's really not a whole lot of pollen in the air yet but there's there's definitely something all right and we have ooh, I like the look of this we have inner light herbal bath use this bath as a focus meditative ritual in embracing inner light place herbs in mud oh it's muslin oh I should have known that yeah okay so that's what this is for this is um, to put your your bath herbs in it although I guess you probably could just put it right in the in the bathtub although I will say and I, I'm only gonna warn you because I've done it if you do put plants herbs uh, flowers whatever right into your bath water if you don't rinse them down the drain or sort of wipe them out with a paper towel right away they might stain the enamel not usually permanently but just that that is a thing so just um, be careful about that if, if you didn't know that was a thing so that's those two go together the muslin pouch should actually take care of most of that problem I'm just gonna continue to excavate but I think that's everything I'm just gonna make a huge mess on my computer desk that's okay let's go to our table of contents that's not called a table of contents our raw sodalite stone yes we got that our bone set herb yep inner light herbal bath yes definitely looking forward to that or a cleansing spray got it chakra balancing oil yes indeedy uh the uh, cone incense yes we did we got that and the candle yes yes we got that and the custom decal decal however you want to say it so pretty happy with this box um, as I said some of the scented things are maybe not as strong as I personally would like however I do recognize that that might be because I'm uh, a bit congested at the moment with um, with uh, the starts at least of some seasonal allergy so that's probably not the hag swag's fault that's that's probably on me so another lovely box from the Hagswag subscription people so thank you for hanging out with me I apologize if this is a little bit late but uh, life life just happened as it uh, as it sometimes does so uh, thank you for spending some time with me I hope you and your loved ones are safe and well and that we are all moving forward into better, brighter things, and happier times. Bye, folks.